function prototype return type function name open bracket arg hyphen type name hyphen 1 arg hyphen type name hyphen n close bracket close quote a function prototype provides the compiler with the description of a function that will be defined at a later point in the program the prototype includes a return type indicating the type of variable that the function will return it also includes the function name which should describe what the function does the prototype also contains the variable types of the arguments arg type that will be passed to the function optionally it can contain the names of the variables that will be passed a prototype should always end with a semicolon double square d double number void print underscore report open bracket interport underscore number close bracket semicolon int get menu choice open bracket void close bracket semicolon prototype function function definition a function definition is the actual function the definition contains the code that will be executed the first line of a function definition called the function header should be identical to the function prototype with the exception of the semicolon a function header shouldn't end with a semicolon in addition although the argument variable names the optional in the prototype they must be included in the function header following the header is the function body containing the statements that the function will perform the function body should start with an opening bracket and end with a closing bracket if the function return type is anything other than void a return statement should be included returning a value matching the return type function definition program parameter a parameter is a special kind of variable used in a subroutine to refer to one of the pieces of data provided as input to the subroutine these pieces of data are called arguments parameter means values supplied to function so that function can utilize these values parameters are simply variables difference between normal variable and parameter is that these arguments are defined at the time of calling function formal parameter parameter written in function definition is called formal parameter although formal parameters are always variables actual parameters do not have to be variables actual parameter parameter written in function call is called actual parameter one can use numbers expressions or even function calls as actual parameters example void main open close bracket int num1 display open bracket num1 close bracket semicolon void display open bracket int space para1 close bracket num1 is called actual parameter parameter list a function is declared in the following manner return type function name open bracket parameter list comma and so on close bracket open bracket body and so on close bracket return type is the variable type that the function returns this cannot be an array type or a function type if not given then int is assumed function name is the name of the function the function return type the function return type specifies the data type that the function returns to the calling program the return type can be of any c's data types c h a r i n t l o n g 
एफ एल ओ ए टी और डबल वन कैन ऑल्सो डिफाइन अ फंक्शन दट डज नॉट रिटर्न अ वैल्यू बाई यूजिंग अ रिटर्न टाइप ऑफ वॉइड गिव एन फ्यू एग्जाम्पल्स रिटर्न टाइप प्रोग्राम कॉलिंग फंक्शन देर आर टू वेज टू कॉल अ फंक्शन Any function can be called by simply using its name and argument list alone in a statement as in the following example If the function has a return value it is discarded wait open bracket 12 close bracket semicolon The second method can be used only with functions that have a return value because these functions evaluate to a value open bracket that is their return value close bracket they are valid c expressions and can be used anywhere as a c expression can be used calling functions an expression with a return value used as the right side of an assignment statement Here are some examples. In the following example, half of is a parameter of a function print f. Open bracket, open quote. Half of percentage d is percentage d close quote comma x comma half underscore of open bracket x close bracket close bracket semicolon. First the function half underscore of open close bracket is called with the value of x and then printf open close bracket is called using the values of x and half underscore of x In this second example multiple functions are being used in an expression colon y is equal to half underscore of open bracket x close bracket plus half underscore of open bracket z close bracket semicolon although half underscore of open close bracket is used twice the second call could have been any other function the following code shows the same statement but not all on one line a is equal to half underscore of x b is equal to half underscore of z y is equal to a plus b block structure a program is made up of one or more functions with one of these being main open close bracket function is a self contained block of program that performs a particular task this is called the structure of function example of block structure of program how to create blocks using open close bracket and their significance 